Hi guys, let's quickly look at how to use Bitto to debug your code. Uh, in this case, uh, I'm basically using Bitto with 10x developer plan and my code is indexed. So I'll be using Bitto's support uh, for your code. Now out here, let me try to compile this code and see if there are any issues. So I'm trying to compile and run a simple Java code which is listing files in a directory. So list files in directory Java. I'm trying to compile it, I get an error, very simple error. So, you know, I can also fix it, but let's ask Bitto to solve it. In my code, compiling, you know, this specific file. It is giving error. Let's put the error out here. and see what suggestion we get from Bitto. Okay, it says to fix this, pass the directory path as a command line argument when compiling the file, then retrieve this argument. So let me see file directory path. So I have to basically add this in and probably my error should be fixed. Let me save this and let me run the compile command. Cool, it works. Now let me actually run it on a test directory. Let me show you the test directory out here. It's in downloads and test folder. Okay, let me do an ls minus al. So this is the directory listing that I should get all the files. And you know, there are some linked files. So let me run this piece of code. Java and list files in directory. I need to give command line argument. Let me push this out here. Man, it's going in an infinite loop, uh, probably with links. So let me actually try to fix this. Okay. So I'd like to print the link files, but you know, not go into the infinite loop, right? And let me look at the directory listing once again. So in my code, you know, this particular file, list files, in my code, Java is with link files fix the code so that go into an infinite loop with and Let's see what it suggests. Okay. So it says keep the main function as is. And then, you know, I should change this, but then if it's a directory or symbolic link, you know, go to list files. And not symbolic link, it goes to list files. Otherwise, you print the absolute path. Okay. Now, let me take this piece of code out here and go and modify my code. Okay. And I save it. Let me recompile it. See. mention this and 
see what I've included so I need to include these things also right uh, stop generating let me pick this up then put it here save it let's try to decompile mm. symbolic link okay Let's also modify a little bit of code. So let me actually compile, take the whole code, put it here, save it, and let's see if it compiles. So it did compile, which is good. Now let me actually run this. And it did list all the files along with link files. Cool. So this is how you use Bitto uh, to debug your existing code using you know, Bitto's support for AI that understands your code and using you know either the error messages that you see during compilation or when you're running you know specific cases that you would like to fix now this is a very simple example but you get the gist of how to debug thanks